everyone, welcome to the restaurant show. And I have executive chef Robin from the Poseidon. How are you? I'm well, how are you? Great, great. I'm so excited because you have absolutely fantastic food that's about to come out of this studio right yeah. now. <laughs> thank you very much. But thank you for coming. So what are you gonna be showing us today, chef? Uh, we're gonna be doing a uh, gluten-free calamari. And that's correct, I said fried food. I, I was like, wait a second, gluten free. Yeah. <laughs> it's gluten free and fried. Uh, we use a, a special batter that has cornstarch and then a, a cornmeal batter. We use that or inch fish fry. And Instead then, so, of flour. Exactly, so it makes it really crispy and right. tastes really good. Right, and you kind of just came up on that and all of a sudden it's like, this yes. is a really good product. It was definitely by accident. Yeah, and but <laughs> a great accident happen. And, and so we're gonna do calamari, is that yes. correct? Okay, mm -hmm. all right, let's go for and it. And on the menu it's a Rhode Island calamari, so we have a, um, the tapenade on top there is it's Kalamata olives, cherry peppers, and pepperoncinis, sauteed in garlic, and then it's um, finished off with white wine. Love it. Okay, so, so this is the calamari. Gotcha. Yep. We're gonna put it in egg whites, so we get it here the flour. All right, and I'm gonna I'm the fry cook today <laughs> as I flip it open. All right. So we're gonna take it out of the egg yolks or egg whites. Egg I'm sorry. whites. Okay. And then we'll throw it into our gluten-free batter. Love it. And this is something that you guys do fresh to order. This is the all your. All of your seafood is, it is fresh coming in. I mean, uh, your fishes come in. Your oy I mean, your oysters. I, that's yeah. For the, for the most part, oysters. We have uh, five different kinds of oysters right. in the restaurant at all times. Right. West Coast, PEI, PEIs, everything. Everywhere. And you're coming up on Oyster Month out here, so that's really exciting. The R it month, is. right? Yeah. Any, any month that ends in an R locally here is a great time that's to have right. local oysters. The local ones will be back in September. Yes. Definitely. Um, and now you even have a great happy hour too on those oysters. Also, we do, don't you? we do. Yeah. We do a dollar seventy-five for um, West Coast and specialty oysters, and then it's we beautiful. do a dollar twenty-five for golf. Because you can't go wrong with that. No, that's pretty. That's pretty good. <laughs> and they have a great beer selection, and their um, cocktail menu is fantastic. If you are going to go for um, your happy hour, you have some great happy hour deals actually. So check out their menu for those happy hour deals. Yeah. Key hot oil, guys. Exactly. On this. You got to make sure the oil is nice and hot before you put it in there, or before else you're just going to get nothing. You're exactly. Gonna get... All that nice crispiness is not going to be there. So you're going to put me in charge of this. I am. Well, <laughs> and I'm going to start working on our golf grouper okay. that we have on the other side. And the golf grouper is something that is that on your menu all the time? It is. It's always on the okay. menu. Um, it is a pescatarian dish. A pescatarian. Now tell me yeah. pescatarian. So pescatarian. Because means... I am obviously not pescatarian. <laughs> <It's> pescatarian <laughs> is something that people can eat. That's, uh, they like to eat seafood. seafood. Uh, no meat, just, just seafood. No meat. No. And then it's also uh, veg vegetarian vegetarian barley risotto. So there really is no, there's no chicken stock, no, anything. None. So that's what we're gonna make now. Yep. Okay, beautiful. So I'm gonna put some oil in the pan and we can turn it up a little quick. bit more. Yep. <laughs> so I'll put some oil in the pan <laughs> and then we'll start with our vegetables. And um, now what vegetables, there's, I love the color, beautiful. Yeah. We have uh, uh, golden tomatoes and uh, red grape tomatoes. Right. We have um, cauliflower, Brussels sprouts, and then a little bit of yeah, and then a little bit of. Um, oh, I love the colors. Yeah, the Gorgeous. Colors. So we'll get that sautéing really quickly. It's, we actually uh, this is kind of pre-sautéed a little bit in, in, uh, for purposes of the of the show. Right, 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 right. So what we we'll do? But obviously, yes. <laughs> we're trying to give you the product right on TV <laughs> yeah, in right. seven minutes. So we'll get it going pretty. We're throwing the risotto now. Okay. Uh, risotto when you cook it is just a style of cooking. It doesn't actually have to mean that it's a boreal rice, it, it can mean it's anything. It's there's a style. There's a style for it. So what you do is basically you never stop stirring it. Gotcha, uh, whenever that's you the get, key. Yeah, so right now all I'm doing is kind of getting it, uh, getting moisture put back into the risotto. And that's the vegetable broth This is vegetable using. broth, it is. We make this straight out from just straight vegetables, no chicken, nothing like that. Love it. Um, that now should be is, looking yeah, pretty this done. This is looking awesome. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Now tell me this is one of your favorite at home um, pieces of equipment. It is. That <laughs> came from my house. That actually did. <laughs> I love it. I'm going to put it in here as you're doing that. Now tell me about the other great piece of equipment that you have that's very unique to Poseidon is your grill, right? Which I'm very yeah. jealous of. Yeah. What we have is we have a charcoal grill. A charcoal um, grill in the restaurant. In the restaurant. So whenever anyone in the morning when my grill cook comes in, um, he loads it with charcoal. And then uh, we light it, and it, we got to keep it going. With I mean, it's like the real deal. You got to stoke it. You got to keep yes, it going. Absolutely. It's a lot of work, guys, but the flavor yeah. is fantastic. It is. The flavor is incredible. It burns, uh, charcoal burns hotter than gas, burns right. hotter than. You want Anything that else. white. You want that white. Yeah. It's what's gonna completely white hot. And that's kind of what we got going on here. I mean, this is the grouper that we got. This from, is the uh, grouper that I grilled on the grill before I came here because I don't have a charcoal that. grill with me. That is good. If we could wheel it in, we would. Then. That would be nice. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And then now the other thing about your fishes is what are some of the? Um, I mean, you get fish fish in 
every day. Yeah, every day. Uh, we've gotten in right now today, we're getting wild king salmon. Okay. Uh, we've gotten in wreckfish. Uh, we get uh, OPA that came in today as well, which is which is totally different. That, yeah, you don't find that very often. No, uh, we were serving a paka paka in the restaurant uh, last week. Uh, we were doing a lot of different. We do a lot of different Hawaiian seafood. We got a company called Norpak. I've had some of the sushi too there. Yeah, I mean some of the the tuna that you're getting in there is just unbelievable. It is, um, and the presentation you guys on the food is is equally yeah. beautiful. Which I hope I don't mess up. I'm gonna go ahead and now you're put good. this on yeah, right. Good, put it now on right is, on top. Okay, Perfect. right on top. That's already been sauteed up in the wine. And yes. then parsley? Yep, just a little smack, a little bit of parsley. And then we have a Meyer lemon aioli. And this is a Meyer lemon aioli. Meyer lemon aioli. Meyer lemon's Beautiful. a little bit different than lemons. It's got a more of a tart flavor to it. Love um, it. Yeah, there it's it's uh, gorgeous. So gorgeous. Once this is getting reduced a little bit, which we're just about there, okay. we're gonna plate that in the center of the plate and then we're gonna put the fish on top. Um, Beautiful. A couple different. Well, as you're plating that up, I'm gonna ask you. So um, as far as different uh, times that you can go to, Poseidon, you have lunch. Early dining, uh -huh. dinner, happy hour, yeah. and brunch. Yes. <laughs> I mean, they have it covered. Yeah. Every single time that you think you would like to eat at Poseidon, they're going to be open for you. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. I love it. Now, yeah, do you 100%. all take reservations? We do. Reservations. Okay. We definitely take reservations. And you can call or... Is there... uh, you can call. You can go through open tables. Okay, and make so that there's different ways yourself. you can get it because, you guys, it's an absolutely gorgeous restaurant. One of the newest restaurants on the island and boasting some of the best seafood and Absolutely. Freshest. It is. And what are we finishing off with here? Uh, this is a miso brown butter. And then we have gremolata oil, which is just fresh herbs, garlic, love parsley. It. extra virgin olive oil and then we finished off with a little bit of micro basil on top thank you so much chef okay. absolutely gorgeous food thank you My for pleasure. coming on and sharing all this with us and um, make sure you guys check out Poseidon over there at Shelter Cove coast-to-coast -coast hospitality that's right love it we'll be back in just a moment